Alrighty guys, welcome back to another single player episode. Uh, last time we were in here, we were buncheering a whole bunch of this section of the trees. Now we have ass tons of trees to skid out of here. So I'm thinking we should probably do some skidding just to kind of clean that mess up because there's quite a bit there. Uh, yeah, and I think I'm just going to haul them all down here. Get rid of that. Boop. Haul them all down to our regular spot here, and uh, yeah, we'll buck them up and make a party out of it. There's definitely a lot of logs to bring down, so we're going to try our best to see what works the best. are light enough if I can pick them up. That'd be handy. Nope. Damn it. I guess that's slightly more realistic. What I should do is maybe just bring the load over here and just go pick them up. Do some hill... some hill, uh, hoe chucking here. Just a little bit now. We're not really doing any sorting, just want to get them out of the way. Only got one there. We got these two here. And these two are a little screwed. 
smash these guys together. And there, we should be pretty close to it lined up here now. And then we're gonna try to grab the whole works. Checked. Oh, I never thought of that. I can just load from this side. Here and get this file. Oh, I should have grabbed that one. Not light enough. Damn it. Oh, look at that. Slidey mix sliders in here. God, what a fucking mess. God, that's irritating. Okay, I'm just gonna leave that shit. I'm gonna have to go hoe check all that back together. Actually, I just wanna chip it. That's how mad I am at that pile for being so shitty. In real life, logs don't slide like that. Not like that. Not unless you're on ice or something, but normally they dig into the mud. One of the regular frustrating bullshit physics things of this game. See, it irritates the living shit out of me. Why this thing sometimes, like, vehicles will just automatically start driving for it. It's not like I hit any particular key, it just, they do it. Back up the hill. Mm, let's get the rest of those. 
to bring those other ones yet, but I'm sure we'll figure something. Sure, good enough for me. single one of these. It's a big, big pile, but we can get them. Can't we now? Very heavy load, but we got it. Logs and machines were stable enough that you could just uh, drive over the piles like you see real skittermen do. Drive over to the back end and just drop them. That'd be beautiful. Unfortunately, you can't quite do that in this one.
wondering if there's a better place here. I'm just gonna take a gander. You know, it's actually kind of flat in here. Hmm. So, let's see here. So, if we drag and drop them like in this little shelf right here maybe then we can process them right to left into this little thing and then we can have that truck come right up here fuck it let's do something different let's change loading areas that's what we're gonna do so what we're gonna do uh, if this will work What I would like to do is park the loader like up here so that I'm loading off onto the side of that truck so that truck can come in down here. It's nice to have this little bench. Uh, so that would mean where we have to skid the logs to to process them. We'd have to park the processor up on this bench first, I think. And then skid the logs in this way, I guess. So then you reach down to the bench, process them up onto the bench. Then after all logs are processed, the truck can come through, swing through. We can cut a little path through here, that's no big deal. Yeah, okay, well. well let's try it. What do we got to lose? Not much, that's for sure. Just all of our, uh, our skidding piles are kind of laid the wrong way, but that's okay. and literally just reach down to that hole. There, I gotta do something real quick here. There we go. Just have to change our lighting a bit. It gets so hard to see when it gets dark. Actually, it's probably even hard to see on the YouTube video. This one starts to get kind of dusky and dark. Alright, uh, okay. I don't know, I think this will be a good drop spot actually. I think this will work out really good. Or maybe I'll be completely wrong and I'll just be so frustrated and you can't handle it anymore. Oh, 
what we'll, maybe what we'll do is we'll just lay all the hit trees downhill from now on, I guess. While we're going up instead of uphill. Let's see if that makes a difference. Might. Might not. I don't know what we're going to see. This game's physics engine continues to uh, surprise me all the time. It'll be a neat little benchy spot, though, if we get it working right. out of the hole up onto where the skitter is making two little piles uh, it might roll a little bit but it shouldn't be too too bad and then yeah once we've cleaned up the whole pile we can literally bring the truck in in that little cove or back it in if we really want to and then the loader will be sitting up high we can just fill it up from the bunks that sounds like a perfect plan If we do come in and do a bunch of hoe checking, I can literally just leave them be. Oops. Oh, I guess that tree's not coming with us. Or if it's quicker to go this way, I don't know. It's a perfect time to bring up the uh, loader, or not the loader. Uh, what else we got up there? I can bring the buncher up actually and fix that. Damn. I think I can squeeze through here with this guy, probably. Oh, yeah, we're good. If not, you can always cut your way out, I guess, with this thing. to the rescue. Let's smoke down these giant trees too. While I'm up here. Since we're not going that way anyway, maybe I'll fall that way. Maybe a good thumbnail. Oops, I knocked the skitter over. <laughs> a little stuck there, eh, hey, Frank? There we go. Perfect. I'm just gonna park this guy right here for the time being. So we're gonna knock down these big trees.
go. Those are now out of the way. on perfect, but we're going to try to kind of keep it a little bit even-ish. That's the way to do it. What were we thinking? Put a on? Oh, that makes life easier. Oh, see, this is what we should have been doing. What were we thinking? these freaking things though. Holy cow. And the tops so I'm just going to put over in La La Land somewhere. Whatever, I'll just leave it over there somewhere. It doesn't really matter. Okay. And we got one more and then I'll end the video. But I wanted to cut this last tree because it's just it's here. You know what I'm saying? Do you get what I am saying? Perfect. I'm just gonna basically chuck them on the truck. Let's see where we get with them. Now we're now turned the buncher into a processor. Frickin' why not, man? There we go. 
not 100%, but hey. Close enough. Meanwhile, these tops are bigger than the bases of most of the trees we have. <laughs> Oh, let's combine it all. What's the point? This will just be an extra five minute long video while I dick around with all this stuff. Hey. Mm. The thing about this game is all these little things take time little movements and shifting things around and finding better better ways to do stuff. It all takes time. But it's actually pretty fun to play again. I'm probably like, what, 10-ish episodes in or something? Ah, it's pretty good. I'm pretty happy with playing and I'm still modding too at the same time. I'm actually working on this really crazy looking, uh, I don't know what it is. It's like, uh, it's like an automated processor almost, I guess would be the way to put it. It's basically a big boxy looking, uh, thing that you drop a group of long trees into. Not these trees, these are something special, but any of the other trees on this map, you can grab a whole groupage of them and drop them into this thing. And, uh, yeah. Just kind of automatically process them by opening kind of like this gate and letting a log fall through and then you run it, turn the processor on, cut it, whatever length, shoot it out, go to the next one, go to the next one, go to the next one. I don't know if it's necessary. I want it to be faster than the other processor, but I don't necessarily know if it's going to be that much quicker. I'm just going to park this right here. Beauty. B E A beautiful. We should need picture twos for fun. All right, okay, I better go. This video is getting too long, so I'll talk to you guys on the next.